Hi everyone, thanks for joining in into this course of Open Radio Access Network. I'm so excited to take you forward through this course of Open RAN. In this section, we'll be talking about Open RAN overview and we'll cover certain important topics such as origin of Open RAN, what exactly the Open refers to in Open RAN ecosystem, what are the different terminologies we should be aware of that are present in Open RAN. There are certain standards and standard bodies who are continuously evolving. The Open RAN ecosystem will touch base upon that. There are certain design goals which are defined by Open RAN while making and evolving this overall ecosystem. Along with the advantages in Open RAN, there are certain challenges also to implement them in the real world. We'll touch base upon that also. So let's get started. So the very first topic we are going to talk about is the origin of Open RAN. There is a community called TIP, which is a telecom infra project, which is led by Meta or Facebook. There are different companies and vendors, operators, suppliers in telecom, as well as in IT industry, who came together to collaborate and work towards innovating the radio access network. Now, the aim of these communities is basically to accelerate the innovation and commercialization in radio access network domain. They are collaborating to produce new products and solutions which are interoperable across the board. And by having more innovation into this domain, they can produce new services which are easily available for any operator to use. There are certain other important communities which are working towards evolving the overall ecosystem of Open RAN, such as ORAN Alliance, Small Cell Forum. We'll talk about them in the subsequent slides. So, so far, it's important to understand who is working towards evolving the Open RAN. In the next slide or the next lecture, we'll be talking about what actually the Open RAN is. I'll see you there.